half of Nigeria's population is believed to reside in rural areas, and that number continues to grow. The Tropical General Investments Group, TGI, observes that for Nigeria to advance, stakeholders must harness the potential of rural resources in an inclusive and sustainable manner. Minister of Budget and Economic Planning, Abubakar Bagudu, alongside other discussions at this session, provided their perspectives on how rural inclusion can be a transformative force. The ability to support them has remarkably increased because technology has now made it possible for extension services for information. Development happens as the grassroots. So we are collaborating, co-creating with sub-nationals. Um, for instance, the governors of Kassina and Niger State, they have committed a minimum of 25,000 hectares of land. So we're looking at developing the cotton value chain. Titled Rural Economy, the Good, the Bad and the Ugly, this session served as a platform for in-depth discussions on social services, security, and the economy, particularly job creation for rural areas. If we do not focus on those segments of our economy, that means we are not even talking about GDP growth on a serious level. Whether it is our oil and gas resources in the Niger Delta, it is rural Niger Delta, it is not in the cities. Whether it's solid minerals in Zamfara, it is again rural Zamfara. How do we get all parties to even understand this rural economy. Sustaining and expanding economic activities in rural areas is critical to Nigeria's long-term development. In Abuja, Muplang, Dakok, NTN News.